All right, what is up guys? My name is Brian and I work for an artist named Buff Kluvi. So earlier today, I was actually working on some of my own stuff and I found myself just trying to overload my songs again, you know? I've talked to you guys about this before where I feel like lo-fi should be catchy, simple melodies, but oftentimes I'm just trying to like, just keep loading onto it, try to make it something that it isn't. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys just how easy it is for you and myself, I guess, to remind myself how easy it is to make a beat that's simple but still sounds really good. So I have a like pattern with the guitar that I made right here. It sounds like this. From the start, I'm gonna tell you guys right now, this is the only melody I'm gonna be using. That's how simple it's gonna be. <laughs> I've decided that this is the only melody I'm gonna be using. So let's get into it. So first thing I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna strum the chord. So now it sounds like this. I'm going to put it into the mixer. I'm gonna put RC20, cut out the highs and the lows. Put a low filter on it. So I got all that down, so I'm going to put it right here. And then now I'm going to the Somatics Eternity kit and I'm going to put in a perk loop. This. Do the mixer and put a love filter on it. And then I'm also gonna put a little stereo on it. I like using the stereo too in the stereo shaper. Um, it kind of like widens it out a lot. Now um, the perk is already there, and so I'm actually not gonna put it in the hi hat because a lot of the gaps are already filled in by the perk loop. So I'm just gonna put in a kick and a snare. So another thing about the snare is usually you would see me put on the snare every like second and fourth for something like this. But if you want a more like laid back vibe, you can also go for putting the snare on every third. So it's something like this. Just every now and then if you want to switch it up. Um, it's personal preference. A lot of people make this snare pattern like their main I usually put it on the second and the fourth, but sometimes I do want to vibe like this. So that's what I'm going for today. So I'm going to put these in the mixer as well and put a love filter on it. Um, and then I'm going to lower the pitch a little bit of the snare. And then I'm also going to put in a little like ambience. I'm actually only going to use the this part because I don't want all these like extra like variations. I just want to like keep it in the background so nothing too like crazy. Put in a love filter. got a notification from Yugen saying he put one of my songs Endless Nights on his channel. Go check it out if you haven't. It's Yugen and the song is called Endless Nights by Kluffy. Sorry for the random shout out. I don't know. That was just like out of nowhere. Back to the thing. Um, I'm gonna put Stereo 3 for the background ambience. I'm just gonna put a bass and then that's gonna be it. So the bass I'm gonna be using is a double bass from X-Band 2. It sounds a lot more like airy, I don't know, and that's the right way to describe it. Put that in the mixer. So 
So yeah, that's it for the beat. Sounds good, super simple, like I said. So let's hear what it sounds like. Yeah, that's it. So I just want to remind you guys that it's good to be ambitious with your songs and, you know, put in new things, try new things you haven't tried before in your other songs. But sometimes, like, you don't want to force a song to become something that it isn't. Songs like Lo-Fi should be, in my opinion, catchy. Like, they have a catchy melody and they just, like, develop on that idea. It shouldn't have, like, you know, four or five melodies all in one song, just, like, trying to, like, compete with each other. But yeah, um, that's it for the video. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you do so. I keep telling you guys, but this is a lo-fi dedicated channel. So if you're interested in lo-fi, either as a producer or simply just a listener, make sure to subscribe to the channel. And also uh, go check out the song on Yugen. Yeah, that was random, but it popped up. So I'm just telling you guys. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching.